Hello, everybody. Hey, we're together again. It's been a long time. I'm so excited to have you all here and to bring you into my space and to be able to interact with you in person and live, in person and live. Anyway, before we get started, if you have not subscribed yet, hit that subscription button. My goal today is that I get 60 more subscribers. So will you be one of those 60 if you haven't already? Anyway, I'm very excited. We It's a beautiful day. It's a great way to start the day together. I want to welcome Chris Ghost, the first one to be on here. Jerry, the very first uh, fan of mine for my first live. He actually helped me practice, and uh, he'll listen to this later. He usually goes to church on Sunday. Uh, Elaine, you're here from all around the world. Daniel uh, loves feet, and we're glad that you're here, and I love shoes, and they go on feet, so that works out together. As you notice, I probably have a little bit of a cold, so I'm glad I can't expose you, but I do don't, I don't sound quite normal, <clears throat> but thank you for your patience. Camille, I'm so delighted to have you here. You've always been my model. Uh, I love to just see what you do. You're so gorgeous in every way and such a sweet, sweet spirit. Um, thank you very much for your support. Uh, I'm very excited she's going to send me a pair of shoes and even an outfit to go with it. So keep watching because you will see with me what she's going to surprise me with. It's such a kind thing. The great LKHS. That must be a high school that you love. And Dr. Charles. You're here, Charles of many uh, names. So we know him as Dr. Charles, but he might tell you what his other ones are. Phillips, 801. Thank you so much. This is a fun, gorgeous latex. Let's show you what it looks like. It's perfect for spring, right? And I never knew I liked pink until I tried this on. And this is such a gorgeous color. And all the shine is wonderful. What do you think? What's not to like about this, right? Great color, great glimmer shine, a little bit of glamour. So let me know if you like it. Ryder, welcome. And Samuel, thank you so much. I appreciate that. And Jess, the queen of heels. Jess, you especially going to like this one because I have a lot of fun little heels that remind me of you. So I hope you enjoy it. So why don't we get started? Today we're going to look at what I found just out walking, you know how a woman, well, we all like to shop, let's face it. I don't actually like to shop in reality. It's, I'm impatient. So when I fall across some great sale, I'm right in there on it. And I found a great sale. I saved like 80% on these shoes. They were fun to buy. They're in the wrong size, but they still fit. So what kind of shoes are they? They happen to all be transparent shoes, which I don't usually wear, but they were really fun. So I thought, Okay, let's try it. So Frank, hold on. And Sandor, welcome. Ian, welcome. Let's get started. And yes, Phillips, they are mules. Indeed, they are all mules, except the very last one. So stay with me till the very end because I'm bringing in a special heel that is not a mule. And it's one that many of you have asked for. And I don't actually have a lot of T-strap sandals. And this was a T-strap unusual kind of transparent shoe. So I will show you at the end. All right, let's get started. My first one today is from Liliana. It's called Ray Ray. And it's a transparent mule with a really fun shape to the heel. This is not a pencil stiletto, but it is creative, a fun line. You're going to see the foot right in here with this transparent bed for the foot. It's nice and uh, got a nice cushion here, and it's going to be easy to walk on with this nice support. All right, let's try it on and see if we like it. And I like how it kind of fits into the pink. I guess I need both shoes, do you think? <laughs> also, they have a square toe, that square toe, which I don't usually wear as well.
So these are a whole size. It's smaller than what I wear, but I think when I wear them, it will push, it will let me kind of fit into them. So I usually am an eight. This is a seven. I also wore an ankle bracelet today for those of you that love ankle bracelets. Look, they're great. Uh-oh. I don't think you can see them. Let me point you down a little bit. There you go. They're very comfortable. They walk nicely. Oh, I can see they're going to be a staple. They're very um, versatile, both in color, with the transparent top, and then the subtle pink on the bottom. I'll be able to wear them with a lot of things. Okay. What do you think? Is that a keeper? I think so. So let's welcome more people who are joining us right now. And welcome to everyone that's watching this later. Michael C., welcome from France, maybe. Karim, Josh, Fred, Pascal, Marco. And there's Dr. Charles saying good morning. Thank you so much for being here. All right, let me know, thumbs up, if you like that first pair of heels, these Lilianas. If you have not yet subscribed, please do. We are working on getting 60 new subscribers in this live. So if you haven't subscribed yet, please do that. Help a girl out or send it and share it to somebody you know hasn't yet subscribed that loves heels that would like to be kept abreast of the best heels ever, every single day with a short or a Sunday live. No, no pantyhose today, Dr. Joe, Dr. Joe, PhD. Wonder what you studied, but let us know. All right, ready for box number two? From Diva Lounge. Makes me excited just to look at this box. All right, let's see what's inside. So we went from a solid heel, transparent top, to, hmm. Transparent heels, transparent top, both. All right, so this is an unusual mule. Look at this heel. Very cool. Chunky heel, but you can't really tell it's chunky because it's transparent. <laughs> See through. Nice from the back. All right, these are just a bunch of playful heels. They're going to be perfect for summer. Perfect for throwing on with casual outfits. Uh, I think they're all squared toes. We'll see what the last one is, except my very last shoe, which I'm bringing out to show my fans who love a special type of shoe, which I don't have much of. So stick with me to the end so you see that. All right, let's try these on. All right. Once again, they have a nice cushion. They help the ladies out. And let's see how they look. Normally you can grab the heel and pull them on. I can't really do that. <laughs> but we got it on anyway. All right, let's try. All right, that's great. So maybe I should try on more sevens because they seem to fit pretty well. What do you think? Do you like these heels with chunky, transparent, square bottoms? Let's see how they walk. Does it look like I'm walking on air? Hmm. 
And they seem to be staying on quite nicely. Sometimes they slip out of mules. Very, very nice. Let's see, do you like them? Hello, Stallion Guns. Hey, Frank R. Where are the pink stilettos? Oh, today we're doing transparent, but we'll find some pink for future. Tony, nice to see you. All right. Uh, da -da -da -da. Let me show you these one more time. So, transparent heel, transparent top. Which do you prefer so far? Number one or number two? All right, shall we go for our third? All right, what will the third be? And I think this will be your favorite, Jess. You guys tell me if you think Jess, the queen of heels, would like these shoes from a company called It's. Ready? <laughs> Does that remind you of her or what? That is just pure bobble fun. Look at the fun shape on the heel, the steel rod in the back, transparent plastic on the outside, or I guess rubber, I don't know what we call it. Nice, good, solid heel. For you men who don't usually wear heels, sometimes you do. It really does help to have a nice square. And then this, which I'm not sure if you should consider an adornment or a weapon. I also like the black of the base. I think that's a nice contrast. What do you think, guys? Hello, Christopher. Christophe. Glad to have you. Thanks for joining us. All right. <laughs> These are quite fun. A little hedgehog, right? A little porcupine. All right. How we doing? Did I get some more subscribers? If you haven't hit the subscription button, hit that subscription button now so you don't miss any more. Thank you very much. We're down to maybe 50. I can't really see it while I'm doing it. You can probably see it, but I'm trying to get to 22,000 subscribers and I'm almost there. I'm just like 50 short. So I hope some of you are subscribing if you haven't yet. And welcome to our channel. We kind of like what we do here. And you'll see from my comments. Okay, let's put these on. Uh, let's put the left one on first. Okay, here we go. Perfect. Well, I like that. I like that you can see a little bit of the heel because you know me, I really enjoy a good stiletto heel. So it's transparent, but because of the steel rod in there, it's not really transparent. That's what I like about a mule. You can just slip it right on. Oh, very nice. Boy, I'm starting to feel like spring might be around the corner when I wear outfits like this. You know, we all like a good summer outfit and great, easy summer heels. So we're almost there. All right, let's take these for a walk. Yes, they are easy with that extra square on the bottom of the heel. I'm gonna call those my cute little hedgehog shoes. <laughs> All right. Hello, BBHC, you're here. I'm glad you made it. 
So thank you, Stallion. No, I'm not single. I'm married to a very lovely man. Thank you, Steve. You like all the central curves in the arches. Me too. Hello, Michael D. Thank you. All right, so those are heels number three. Are you ready for the fourth and final heel? That helps round out my collection because it is a T-strap heel. Hello, I mean, glad you made it. All right, it is in the category of transparent. I'm gonna hide it because the heel does have a transparent base to it, but they filled it with something. All right, this is a Cape Robin shoe. It is a T-strap. And the heel is transparent, but they filled it with gold. All these are just fun, playful summer heels. So let's put on this heel that is not a mule. It has a lovely T-strap, strappy sandal effect. And let's see how you like those with the outfit, all right? Hello, NS Jr. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Hey, Fred. Thank you for liking my pink latex. I like it too. I had to pull it out of the closet. I kind of not worn it because it seems to have gotten some stains on it. Like, I don't know, it was packed in a box or something. Any of you know how to get, see this? Wouldn't notice unless I showed you. Most women know that. But <laughs> if you know how to get that off of latex, let me know. Or vinyl. All right. Cape Robbins, lovely golden shoe with a golden glitter filled heel. You know, if you guys like close ups of this process of putting on heels and hosiery, check out my Patreon. That's all we do on that channel. So, patreon.com, stunning stilettos, you will find me. And you get a lot of nice videos that take a good long look at legs and lingerie and hosiery and heels. All right, let's tie this one. And then we will take it for a walk. Thank you so much for coming. Don't forget to Subscribe. Let's see if we can meet the goal. I'm going to go look afterwards to see if we got up to 22,000 with your help. All right, shall we see how they walk? I like them. I'll take it a little bit so you can see the front of the heel. Yeah, as much as I like mules, I, I think I like sandals even better. I don't know. I like them all. That's why I have this channel. And thank you to the many of you that send me gifts that help beef up my collection. Well, thank you for spending some of your morning with me. Make sure you go over and check out Camille next and Jess the Queen of Heels at the top of the hour. We love to bring you our favorite heels and shoes. Thank you so much. Thanks again, everyone. Casey Dog, you made it. Michael, Stefano, thank you so much. Thanks for your shared love of shoes and heels. Have a wonderful week, and I'll see you next time.